You are listening or watching Sex, Drugs, and Skincare with Nikki Davis and Sandro Yokoano. Hi, everybody. I am Nicole Davis, Nikki Davis. I had uh, a couple, uh, I went, I had a few facial procedures done, just some massages, and uh, that's about it. But welcome back to Sex, Drugs, and Skincare. And do you want to say something? What, should I do a better intro? No. Okay. Yeah. I'll do, well, let me try it again. Okay. Yeah. All right, All right. Right. Hey, what's up, everybody? Okay. Uh, I think we got the first one, so I can the rapid eye movement will work. I think on the second one. Welcome back to Sex, Drugs, and Skincare. Um, I just wanted to welcome everybody. Just take a moment to uh, just say hi to everybody, because my name is Sandro, and Nikki usually hosts it, and I would like to give her a break. She's had a long week. And uh, she's she's been she's been clipping coupons. She clips coupons and then shreds them immediately. She just wants something to do. Was that is that fair? Sure, yeah. Yeah, that's fair. Are you relaxing right now? Oh yeah, I'm sorry. I was I was actually not listening to you. Okay, talking, good. So. It must be nice to, to relax in the corner yeah, when you don't. Gotta, yeah, you don't have to do anything. Yeah, like you know, like I'm I'm work. This is this is a lot of work. Right. So I'm glad that you're having time just to chill out. That's yeah, that's cool. And then you can remain chill and then you can come out and glow because, you know, it's about skincare and I'm excited for today's episode. Can you I'm, just do the whole thing like this? Sure. Either the relationship or uh, <laughs> or the podcast because I think, Both. yeah, <laughs> love seed, love seed is the best love seed is two of them. That's actually really good. Yeah, because if not, it's just a, a like seat. It's just, a it's, just it's, seat. it's a crap seat. <laughs> it's a crap shoot? Crap, crap, cramp seat. Cramp seat. Yeah. Yeah, that works. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna um, bring out your host for the show. I, I I'm looking forward. I've I've never met her in my life, uh, but I'm looking forward to uh, having her out here. You guys know her. You love her. Let's welcome everybody, Nikki Davis. Thank you. Oh, there you are. What's up? That was really nice. Did you like that? Yeah, I got to take a little bit of extra time to like. You were just hanging out, kind of just relaxing out. a bit. Yeah. Nice. Cool. So this is my show. Uh, no, I'm kidding. This is your show. I was just. Uh, it is. Well, it's partially your show. Well, you know, it doesn't have to be. It can you know? I will do it without you. Oh wow. Okay, now it's mine. Okay. Oh. Oh. So it's a either or situation. Yeah. I'm not a very good improviser. <laughs> I'm an either or. <laughs> yes or. <laughs> yes or. Yeah. Let's see. Oh, I'm just trying. I'm sorry. I'm straightening out the mic. Yeah. I'm getting some. Uh, some. Acum, some acums. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. What is that? Oh, like uh, notes. Yeah. From the producer. Yeah, acums. That's what I'm gonna call them now. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Like little, like little nuggets of uh, just little nuggets of wisdom. Yeah, nuggets yeah, yeah of, I like that. Yeah. That's cool. I'm picturing acorns filled with like, oh, epiphanies. Like yes. Oh, because acorns. Well. <laughs> Here comes. Oh. Um, no, I'm not gonna go in a bunch of puns on Mark's name because he deserves better than that. So he does. We'll just uh, we'll do it behind his back. <laughs> See, he, he agrees. <laughs> he just thumbs up. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just trying to get comfortable and have. You should apologize. All of the right parts that I want to show. I'm wearing two tank tops. Uh, I need to get a bra. Uh, that. Hi, we're doing. By the way, we're doing a uh, gua sha today. Mm. I wanted gua to get that in to earlier. Say. Yeah, I feel like we need to t just to address the the skincare aspect of it. Yeah, it sounds like squash and guava. Squash and guava. Squashva. It's guasha. It's guasha. Guasha. It's two words. What's what's the origin of the the word? Is there like oh a... god, really? I don't know. I don't know. The either. paper I have up there doesn't have that. I have to Google it. Okay. I don't know what the origin of the word Mister Gua. Yeah. Of... He was a shah. He was a shaman, and but they oh. just abbreviated it to shah. So guasha. That's pretty cool. Right. It sounds like a, a member of the Wu-Tang Clan. It does, actually. Mm -hmm. Old Dirty Guasha. <laughs> Old Dirty Guasha. Yeah, that sounds like... <laughs> that sounds like the worst skincare yeah. treatment you can ever have. Well, you get like a, you know, like a, like a back alley facial, you know, back alley. <laughs> it's not going to... It's like, you, you know, it's like, oh, you know, it's like discount, but... Because they're... In, I think I heard in Texas they're no longer Black legal. market. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't do that anymore. No. They get rid of a lot of stuff down there. It's a big Just not babies. State. <laughs> It's a, it's the biggest that state was a good joke, sorry. of depression. Which one? You said they get rid of everything there. And I said, <laughs> oh, yeah. just not babies. <laughs> no, no, no. They keep those. Sorry. That was a good joke. That was a good joke. Thanks. I'm sorry. You're I welcome. did talk over you, which I read was one of the 
top 10 things that people hate in a podcast. It can be, but I also think it can be funny if it's just done. Or it's just like when you have a conversation, people talk over each other, you know, like normally. That's true. Or there's also that one person that's like, I catch myself like, I always picture somebody looking at me in a conversation because I'm always talking and I'll start talking and somebody else is talking and I'll just start going. <laughs> <laughs> like you weren't talking? Like, yeah, like <laughs> yeah, it's like falling and then it's like when you, it's like, it's like falling and then pretending to do push ups or something. You're like, <laughs> <laughs> Pretend like you're yawning. I'm yawning. Yeah. That's the worst when you're about to say something really funny and then you say it and you're like, I'm so proud of it. And the yeah. whole rest of the group is it just talks completely through it and you're like, shit, if I say it again, yeah. I'm gonna be that person. Yeah, or or they could have heard it and then you know they're like, Oh, that's really funny. But they didn't say anything. But they didn't out say loud. anything about a lot about it. Could you fix that? Yeah. Okay. Trying to we come here and we decorate when we get here. I like to arrange the uh the fuzzy things in this room. Arrange the fuzzy things. Yeah. yeah. What should we put up in the behind us at some point? We're going to, Mark doesn't know this, but we're going to totally renovate this room. I th uh, we could put like a bedroom set. <laughs> on the like wall? An armoire. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? I think anything could be back there. A bedroom set? <laughs> some like shower tiles. <laughs> just just a stack <laughs> just of shower tiles. Not even like on the wall. Just, yeah, just random, random hardware. Construction. Yeah. Just like paper clips. Paper clips are good. Yeah. Some stuff I need to donate, I'll bring over here. You're first. donating paper clips? Yeah, I wow, donate paper a... clips and clothes. You're so kind. How are you going to hang the clothes up with paper clips? How, or how small are your clothes? It's not, no, it's not that. It's that you have to pull them through. Uh, how much closet space do you have? Do I have? Yeah. I have many closets. You don't have any closets. No, so I use paper clips as, as, as clothes hooks. It's like <laughs> uh, clothes hangers. <laughs> This is the drugs part of the sex, drugs, and skincare podcast. Yeah. This is just the. Did you almost fall? The riffing. Yeah, I almost fell <laughs> off the couch. <laughs> Whoa. Sometimes I, sometimes I fall when I'm sitting. It feels like I'm falling. I'm falling. Yeah. Oh, it's just in front of my face. Yeah, you're good. Well, I don't know. Do you have anything else you want to talk about before we start our. No, I'm kind of curious to do uh, oh. to, the, to do. I like to be called it a situation. Mm -hmm. So I don't really know what we're in store for. Well, it's a treatment that we will give ourselves. As a matter of fact, let's talk about it a little bit first. Mm -hmm. So, like, you didn't know what I don't know the origins of the yeah. origins. It of sounds the like a fancy word. It does. Yeah, it's actually two words, apparently. Okay. Um, G U A S H U A. Those two split up. Okay. Um, it's a natural alternative therapy. Um, a lot of times, it's used on the body to imp improve the circulation and um, it's like it involves like a scraping of the skin right mm -hmm. so like i have a kit of these these are i'm sure one of these is for the body maybe not these look like all facial ones but um and then you just you scrub i mean i, th I think i've done that to you before yeah. and left like big red marks on you on so purpose you just scrub, like <laughs> yeah and in any areas that where it feel like they need more circulation yeah. more um yeah microcirculation uh, you want to do it? Yeah, sure. It's like it's like a, like a almost like a, like a jade like. I think that one is jade. If not, it's a blade. It's, but it's like Amazon jade. Oh, from the Amazon, right? <laughs> oh <laughs> wow, the, that stuff is prime. It doesn't grow on trees, though. Yeah, no, it doesn't grow on trees. Mm -mm. Oh wow. Thanks. No. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, so yeah. So scraping the um, it gets stagnant energy, yeah. which is you know called chi, whatever, mm -hmm. um, which is responsible for inflammation. Uh, it helps to break up energy. It's supposed to, actually it does help with arthritis, things like fibromyalgia. So it'd be great for my mom. Mm -hmm. mm. Um, from Wisconsin. My mom is actually not from Wisconsin, oh, but you said ma'am. Uh, yeah, I know it's from my mom. Oh, I don't know. I didn't. That explanation didn't. Explain away. You don't the have way to explain a riff. You can riff. <laughs> Thank you. You good? I love that I'm learning comedy. Co co I'm learning comedy. I've done that right before. now. Yeah, it's the economy of comedy. It's the the economy. Econom economy. Economy. It's cutting down on all of the words that you don't need to use, particularly all of them. Oh, your hands look really nice right now. Oh, thank you very much. I think it's the lighting. <laughs> I don't think. I think you just have nice hands. Oh, thank you. Remember I, when we were dating? I used to have you send me pictures of your hands. I remember that. That's for another reason though kind of i mean yeah. you know whatever yeah it's because she the camera the you ca like you like cameras yeah he's got okay um 
also this is this is weird for me. Okay, so muscle and joint pain, blah blah blah. Mm -hmm. um, supposedly, it helps with hepatitis B. Like actually doing the the movement. Um, yeah, so on I like, guess on, on the, the body. body, and you always want to do it in an downward motion. Um, if this, if you're doing it on the body, any it, specific part part of the body, any specific part of the body? That's a really good question. I didn't investigate that part. I'm sure that there are parts near the liver that you would want to get because oh, okay. um, right. Hep B is, you know, it attacks your liver, and so um, there was a case study. I forget to did I write down? Oh, was it from Healthlines magazine? Some PhD. By the way, nothing is more uh, like nothing instills confidence in a fact when you're like some study. <laughs> <laughs> Your Honor, there was some study done about some guy with a. But go ahead, please. <laughs> God. If you saw it written up there like that, it would just be like, "What the hell is that?" Um, okay, so um, I'm referring to my notes up there. Yeah. So uh, Hep B. Oh yeah, case study was yeah. After 48 hours experience of someone doing it, they actually saw a decline in the liver enzymes um, and they were less likely to have liver, liver damage. Hmm. According to this study. Yeah, yeah. The no, I, yeah. I don't know. I believe it, maybe. Yeah. I believe it, actually. Yeah. I mean, if, if you're getting circulation going, I don't know how it works, but, you know, I, I believe everything that I'm told. <laughs> so <laughs> All right. just go with it. That's yeah. positive. All right. Yeah. Uh, also... Migraines, breast engorgement, that's one of my faves. Mm -hmm. Breast e. engorgement, B-E. Yeah. Neck pain. Okay. Perimenopausal per syndrome. I didn't know it was a syndrome. I just thought it was part of your life that you went through. I didn't realize it was an actual syndrome. There's like a syndrome that everybody goes through? No, well, just women. I'm, but I mean, you know, every woman oh. goes through a, a syndrome or is I it just... I thought every woman goes through perimenopause at some point. Every oh. woman who was is born with a vagina was... You got to clarify. Yeah, you yeah. did. Yeah, yeah. Well, I did. That was good. Here's the last one that was kind of freaking me out. Not freaking me out, but Tourette's syndrome. Hmm. It helps with <laughs> Tourette's syndrome. something calming in like the actual like motion or maybe. physical? Maybe. Yeah, I wonder. Yeah. Because I don't have like, you know, like when you're in the shower, you know, like I was always told you don't have your period in the shower because when you're in the shower... <laughs> It's just, you know, and I haven't had my period in the shower. What? Is this the Tourette's part? Because I don't know what you're talking yeah. about. I'm just thinking like if you're having a massage done to you, maybe you're less likely to like have like tics or oh. whatever. If you're like, you know, if you focus on that. Right. As opposed to like, you know, like if you're taking a shower, you know, I don't sneeze in the shower. I don't know how you <laughs> going, keep going back to the shower. <laughs> but I think it's funny. I think it's because in your mind, I'm yeah. going to explain that you, your yeah. your brain is occupied with one thing. Yes. And so you're able to clearly think, I write a lot in the shower. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like so I, driving. Yeah, yeah, you write, yeah, exactly. Because you're doing something else and your brain's free to go other places and you're not, you know, you're not like focused on it. Like I'll have like in the shower, I don't have diarrhea in the shower, <laughs> but if I'm out of the shower, I'll have diarrhea. You know, like my body will <laughs> stop, <laughs> stop making diarrhea in it the does? shower. Yeah. <laughs> When I'm in the shower, mm -hmm. it makes it more easily, uh, I'm more easily able to think about taking a shower. Oh, yeah. You focus on that. Right. Wow. That's pretty. So you're double showering. Yeah. The diarrhea thing was a lot funnier than what I said. Yeah. But yours is more relatable, you know, because no one, no one diarrhea is in the shower. <laughs> oh, you don't know that. Well, I mean, you know, unless you press for time or something. <laughs> like you're late for a meeting <laughs> and it's either one or the other. <laughs> I'm sorry, uh, uh, <laughs> Mr. Jones. Yeah, Sandra's going to be 15 minutes late. Yeah, yeah. or am I? Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, exactly. Just, uh, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> Did you say the waffle stomp? The, what's a waffle? Oh, gro oh my God, the waffle yeah, stomp. Yeah, Is that yeah. where you push the poop through That's, the through I'm, the drain? I'm thinking of drains. I'm thinking of drains. And yeah, uh, yeah. you should be thinking of drains. <laughs> Waffle stomp? That's See, that's a, that's an, what would what, you call them? An acum? It's an acum. It's an acum. It's a that's, chestnut of, uh, of. Yes. See, that's a, it's a that chestnut was great. of information. That was great. That, that was very visual. That I hope that I forget very soon. I don't know. I'm, I'm going to Google a lot of stuff after this. You so, are? Uh, okay. <laughs> Mark, Mark shaking his head he no. said no. But I will. Yeah. <laughs> I was kind of, I was kind of hoping you would act out like a Tourette's. But that's mean, actually. <laughs> no, you don't want to do that's that. That's not very. No, that's, that's reappropriating, uh, Tourette a tick. 
Uh, yeah, exactly. Reappropriating a tick. Yeah, that's like removing like a tick off of a dog and putting it on your own skin. Exactly. That's reappropriation. That's so. not cool. Or a clock. A TikTok. Oh, a TikTok. Anyways, I'm losing track here. I, I, I have, I'm I, sorry. We were talking about diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, excuse me. We were. We sorry. do need to stay on track. Sorry. So diarrhea. <laughs> I really messed up that. How many times a day do you have diarrhea? No, just not every day. I got to keep it special. I'm wondering if I'm going to keep this in. I'm just. You never know. Yeah. All right. So that mm-hmm. diarrhea aside. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's, I, that's, that's, I'm, that's my book. <laughs> diarrhea yeah. aside. Um. You uh, and I are going to perform uh, on the face. Now, okay. it's different on the face, okay? It's a lot softer. You use it at a different angle. You're not scraping. Mm-hmm. You're. It's more like you're You're doing it, and I'll show you. It's more of it like a, is that a 45 degree an- it angle? It looks about yeah. 45, yeah. Right, and so you're pulling, You're pu- so it's almost like you can feel the flat part yeah. pulling across, and it's soft. It's So now, remember when we did uh, the other, we did the, Suction cups, yeah, right. Facial cupping, so it's similar in that it's going to help to move lymphatic fluid. It's going to help to smooth out fine lines. The suction is a little more um, aggressive in pulling it up, as far as like breaking up the fascia and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. But this is something that women have been using. I should have looked up to see. Like it's probably thousands of years that women have been doing it, and it seems it seems like it wouldn't do anything, mm-hmm. but it truly does. Um, so I'm going to give you, uh, you want the big one? Oh, wait, how, oh, this is right. There's a different set or is yeah. there, yeah. So you're not, so with the suction, it's basically pulling the skin. Is this one, you're kind of like dragging it, but you're adding like a little pressure? You're like running it over. So you're not oh, okay. actually. You're not actually putting any pressure. You're not putting enough pressure to like do this. Uh, okay. Right. With the suction, it kind of has to pull up and pull out, but then yeah. we were holding it stationary at some a little bit so that we could pull it across without like yeah yeah okay okay so um i'm gonna give you the nice one because i'm i'm a nice girlfriend you're very nice now do you want me to put up your hair uh what kind of styles can i do i'm gonna do it yeah put it up don't get oil in it because uh i've got to shoot um I'm going to edit in a bunch of fart sounds into the camera <laughs> while your butt is towards it. You could have, uh, you know, I could have done it. You got behind me here. There you go. Your head is huge. Yeah, I know. I've been trying to do something about it. Oh God, his head is so enormous. I can't get the fucking, I cannot, I can barely. I've been trying to lose weight on my head, but it's it's difficult because like it's, it goes away from my stomach first. Mm-hmm. And the forehead, they say, is the last place you lose weight. Oh, I heard that. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. And then the temple uh-huh. is usually a place where people go worship. Oh, okay. But that's also <laughs> on your face as well. <laughs> tuck this. Can you tuck that in yeah, yeah. Without, the without hair? Fucking it up? Yeah. I think so. Can I tuck it in without fucking it up? Yeah, well, wow. You know what I'm saying. Jeez. Who my mom? <laughs> who my mom? Can your you mom, do this without your messing mom asked up? You that? Oh, yeah. yeah she said, Can you do this without messing up? She's never said that. No, she's never. She's always said, I love you. <laughs> All right, I'm going to put mine on. Okay. Yeah, don't get too excited. We're, and then we're going to put oil on. Oh, I got to take off my glasses. Don't get too excited. We're going to put oil on. Well, don't you get too excited yet because you were. Oh, because I was about to. You were putting it towards your face and I well, yeah. wasn't ready for you to uh, start dragging it across your. Although you probably. You have pretty oily skin. I do have very oily skin. Okay. Is this out on the right side? Let's yeah, I think you're, yeah, you're good. Oh, okay. Yeah, there we go. Okay. How does that look? Good. Okay. All right. You look like you be you should be drinking a mimosa right now. Oh, I always look like I should be drinking a mimosa. That's true. You do. You have a, it's, maybe it's the the robes or the uh, the flowing shirts. Oh yeah, that is actually. <clears throat> you have like a mimosa. It's a very roper esque. You have a vitamin C vibe, yeah. Vitamin C. Vitamin C and champagne. Oh. Orange juice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, remember? <laughs> oh. <laughs> We were talking about 10 seconds ago. <laughs> remember, remember, remember orange juice? <laughs> yeah. It's been so long. All right. I'm going to take a little oil, put some on your face. <clears throat> okay. You don't have to go super crazy, um, but do your neck too. Um, and then if Mark wouldn't mind putting up that one picture that I did. You drew a picture? Uh, no, I copied it from the internet. Oh, I've done that. Okay. 
Are you able to make that a tiny bit bigger? If not, it's okay. Oh, oh that's, there we go. That's oh, interesting. perfect, though. So I, I pretty much the uh, and I'm going to post the the diagram of how you do it. Um, it's so funny to watch you massage your own face. Am I, am I, am, are, you, are you like, what a rube? Pretty much. Like what, a, what a novice. <laughs> See, I'm just trying to get my hands on my face. That's usually. <sighs> what do you have in your lap? Is that like a, a hitter, a one hitter? It's a, a vaporizer pen. Oh, okay. I, 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 I it vaporizes uh, people that I, I, I give it to. <laughs> they completely he vanish. uses it a lot. Vanish. I vaporize my brain cells. Oh, wait. Did I give you the... Oh, yeah. Here. I have this one. Use that one? Yeah. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Yeah. Sorry. You're right. I was thinking they were the same one. It's not about being right. It's about, are you wrong? (laughs) That's the main thing. Usually I am. Yeah. (laughs) Okay. So we're going to start, and this is very similar to what I was saying, is uh, Mm -hmm. to the suction cup as far in terms of the the direction you're going to go. You're going to go up, out, down, right? Okay. So we're going to go kind of slow. I have a tendency sometimes to go a little bit fast. Mm-hmm. So just for right now, actually just, just do a little bit of like, we'll do the, the mm-hmm. lymph pumping. I'm just going to, I'm going to move this a little bit okay, and sure. then just so I can get some more room. Yeah. So I'll bump it. Bump so, it. W- lift pumping? Just, you know, yeah. So just wake of... up your lymph nodes a little bit. I always recommend to do that a little bit. Just mm-hmm. on your clavicle, on your clavs. Oh yeah. The clavicle. Oh, I should take off my necklace, huh? This is my kitty bus. If you're a professional, you would. <laughs> I don't I leave my I leave my necklace on the nightstand. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. All right, cool. Now you have enough oil on, right? I think so. Okay. So you're gonna take it at a 45 degree angle. Okay. Do mm-hmm. you get the flat side, right? So okay. there are many sides to this, right? So right yeah. Here. So um, and then you're just gonna just go up real slow under the chin. Just do a few strokes, right? I'm doing like the sort of the the whole neck area, actually. Mm-hmm. I want to just bring the energy up. Do a few rounds of that. Yeah. I can feel it and hear it going across like the little the little oh, the stubble hairs. hairs, but it's uh, <laughs> it's kind of relaxing as well. It is really relaxing. Yeah. I'm telling you, when I taught the class on it the other day, I felt so good. Yeah. Um, okay. So now we're going to um, we're going to go to the face. Okay. So we've gotten we're we've moved, we're moving everything up. Now mm-hmm. we're going to move everything to the side, side, just like we did before. Hold on a sec. So I would recommend taking a hand if you can, mm-hmm. and then holding that side, mm-hmm. and then just go across, and it's almost flat. And when you get to the side, right next to your ear, mm-hmm. it's nice to do a little wiggle here because that's where a lot of lymph gets in and like and gets ready to go down here okay and then if you want you can go straight down and kind of or you down. can go cross you know side 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 and then sweep it's up to you gotcha okay so you might be doing it a little bit hard and a little bit not as flat so make it a little flatter like this the, the other way so that it's like almost like this side s- see how yeah see how mine is like almost laying flat mm-hmm. turn it Oh, I yes, see. Yes, exactly. See. Yes, I yes, see. yes, yes, yes. Okay, and then not quite. Well, I, you know how hard it is. I can't tell. So, and you, it's pretty gentle because mm-hmm. the lymph again is right under the skin. It's not a deep tissue thing. So, I'm gonna go across here. Go across the. Oh, I'm, I got to remember. People are listening to this. So I'm down on the lower end, half of the face. I'm holding my chin, and I'm dragging it across at a 45 degree angle, um, to, all the way to right under the ear. And then I'm going to just take a little bit of wiggling right in front Mm -hmm. of the ear with it. It's a little bit harder. And then if you want, then you can just drag it down. And for those who are just listening, the night was sultry. (laughs) So in case you're wondering what the mood was that night, it was sultry. The night was sultry. The night was sultry. (laughs) Um, We just watched Throw Mama from the Train. You say the night was humid? Or do you say the night was moist? That's writing. The night was sultry. I'm getting the hell out of here. Two guys, I'm sultry in here. Rain, yeah. so. <laughs> um, so if you want to work your way up, you can a little mm-hmm. bit. So you want to go all the way across. If mm-hmm. you have to hold here, you can, wherever you feel like, so that you really are moving it across and not pulling okay. the skin with it, because otherwise gotcha. you're kind of not doing... 
Yours look pretty good. They're flat. Okay. Show me, sh oops, show me the pressure you're doing on my arm so I can see. Like this. Okay. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, I feel good. Oh, awesome. <laughs> well, I just want to make sure you're doing it. No, right. I'm. I know. I'm. I'm only joking, but I am serious oh, about really wanting to know what kind of pressure. I should have done this before you before you took your pictures. What the? Uh, oh yeah. You took pictures yesterday. I should have done this for you. Well, now you'll know how to do it on your own. Yeah. So I'll okay, I'll steal your uh, your guashes. Yeah. They look delicious, by the way. I know. I they would do. eat this. <laughs> um, both of our guashes are green and jade. I don't know if they're actually jade. My, maybe. I don't know. Is jade an abundant? Is it a mineral? Is it a rock? I don't is know. I think gem? it's a. Uh, it's a like gem? a gem. Yeah. It's a pretty. It's, it's a, a rock. rock. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, Jade. Jade. It's also a movie uh, that I was not allowed to see earlier when I was growing up. Is it about I think, a stripper? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it might be. It might be something. Who knows what the hell it was about? But I never got to watch it. It had uh, what's his name in it? The guy that was on NYPD Blue. The redhead. The redhead guy. Charlie, uh, what's his face? Uh, no, you're thinking of Charlie Boreanis. He was David Boreanis's cousin. <laughs> Boring anus. <laughs> Boring anus. No, yeah. I don't think that was his name. Uh, You're what the heck's his name? You're doing it too scrapey. Do it flat. So Wait, uh, Caruso. We're in, David Caruso. Oh, that guy. Yeah. yeah. That guy always confused me. Like why people were so into him. He seemed like the least likely action person. Yeah. And, but he's always like super like. Rah. I'm going up now. He's probably a nice guy. He's probably a <laughs> wonderful guy. He's probably makes a good coffee. <laughs> Hold your face a little bit with your okay. other hand, oh, yeah. and then pull it just across. So now oh, I'm up, okay. I'm almost at the cheekbone. Yeah. And now I'm at the cheekbone. And then if you have enough oil under your eye. I do. So you're just going to go. Don't go right under your eye. Okay. Oh, okay. You so can, not right under my eye. So use the, the thinner side. Mm -hmm. So use like a little bit of like a, yeah, that guy there. Mm -hmm. So the, the guashas we have are kind of heart shaped. So okay. we're, I'm using a side that's like, um, yeah, I'm going to use this. It's, it's like longer, like a finger. And then you go over the orbital bone. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay. And out. So you're going around the orbital bone and out. Go slow. I okay. have a tendency to go fast. Go slow. So you, you this would probably be done better before you have like a, a like a lot of coffee. You well, probably don't want to get all jittered up and oh, then start doing yeah, this to your face. Because like, you know just scrubbing your face. I like think you're this doing would, it too hard. This too hard. Okay. So this would be done like before you do crystal meth, <laughs> lower the uh, the gua sha. I'm telling him to lower okay. it to more towards the this right is, here. Here's your orbital bone. Okay. Right. Mm -hmm. Don't go up uh, right underneath in the delicate little eye skin okay. area. Okay. Just go on the orbital. Yeah, just go on the or orbital okay. bone. It's that round bone right there. Gotcha. I understand. Which there's like a million different acupressure points that are under the eye, so it's it's very natural to feel like ah, oh, you start feeling really relaxed. Yeah. All the meridians that go across here, which is really kind of fascinating our whole, i don't want getting distracted so let's keep going um so no, now you're, you're good. no i'm going to talk more about it while i'm doing it though yeah so now go above the eyebrow okay right and do the same on the bone there orbital bone um what was i talking about uh a million pressure points oh there. right yeah so all of our extremities reflect all of the other parts of our body so like uh you know reflexology um i forget what the hand one's called right now um uh, any kind, you know, face massage, like I was saying mm -hmm. before, your ears have 400 different acupressure, I mean, acupuncture points and 200 mm. acup acupressure points. Okay. Don't forget to do a little shake. Now we're going to do a shake on the side of the face and then bring it down. Your face is looking good. It's, I can already see the, uh, thanks. It's smelling good. It is smelling yeah. good. Mm. <laughs> All right. So now do the forehead, um, just a little bit, almost at an angle because the, yeah, you can just drag it across, and then we're going to go straight up. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you're. Oh, he's doing so good. So I'm going across the forehead, starting in the middle. I'm holding mm -hmm. it a little bit. And now let's go up. My arm's getting tired. Mm -hmm. So uh, now just go straight up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Go slow down, though. Because your lymph isn't going to just easily just go. You have to, like, yeah. sort of wait for it okay. and coax it out. And then just go straight up. 
Wait a minute. Okay, yeah. You switched the, your audio on the other side of the face? Uh, no. Okay. I was just moving my hand. I, oh, should, okay. I did go to the other side. I lied, Your Honor. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so now go in the middle. You okay. can do that. And then you can do the same thing. Going up. Right. Up, up, up. And then, um, and then you're going to do the same thing. Um, did I go to the side? I think I did. I don't remember you went to that side. I'm going to go to this side, though. Okay. So now, um, let's see, I'm wondering if we should go up. Yeah. So just go to the other eye now. Mm -hmm. You're going to come down the eyebrow around the orbital bone again. Okay. Right? Do that like five times. Five times is a good rule of thumb for some of these things. My favorite rule of thumb yeah. is keep it out of my soup. <laughs> keep your thumb out of my soup. Just, that's a good rule of thumb. That's, that's a good gets, rule. Gets hot. <laughs> Go over that, over your eyebrow. It's basically over your eyebrow. And then you can go underneath the eye again. Okay. Right? You're doing so good. Thank you. It feels nice. It does feel nice. And go down, I mean, um, go around rather, all the way to your hairline. Your face does not stop. The muscle doesn't stop right at your oh, face. Yeah, so you have to yeah. go all the way as far as you can to the Remember hairline. Remember my gym teacher telling me that? Your what? body doesn't stop at your hair. Go to your hairline. <laughs> And I was like, why are you looking at me like that? I remember in gym class one time, that, <laughs> that was stupid. <laughs> it's like every, uh, anyways. Um, I forget the guy's <laughs> name, Jason something. Jason, oh God, I had it. Robards? No, oh. Jason Robards. Yes, he was in my gym class because oh. we're the same age. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I remember he was sitting cross-legged and because uh, Mr. Frick only, he was also like a, a, an ex-Marine and he okay. would have us like, I don't know. We one group would get up, and then the other group would get. Up. And I was sitting on on the ground waiting for my group to go up, and so was Jason. What's his face? And his sh he had his pants, and mm -hmm. I could see his balls. Oh, his balls came out. Yeah, I was in the eighth grade. Yeah, it was the first balls I ever, aside from my Whoa. dad's middle school balls. Middle school balls. Yeah, aside like from pink. my dad's is like a it's like, it's like a kid. <laughs> aside from my dad's. At that point, I think I had yeah, seen so funny two sets of balls. Are they going to say five balls? I was like, well, why five? But well, there could be five if one somebody only had one. Right. Or you only saw one of somebody's two. That Oh, that's true. Oh, that's true. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So now we're going down the lip. Okay. So we're basically working our way down the face. Do you go over your lips too? Um, That's a good question. I guess you could. I don't see why not. You can just also like do a little bit down here on the lip. Yeah. And then just, yeah, you can move it over. And then it kind of, yeah. Yeah. I don't think there's anything wrong with going over the lips. I have lip gloss on, so that was why I didn't. You glossed over that part. I, <laughs> yeah. I did. Didn't really tell I thought, us no, too I, much. I didn't think you were going to notice. No, I didn't. Um, and then go. I'm down by the chin, moving mm -hmm. out towards the um, outside of my face. Do that five times right at that chin point. And it's also touch, touching my jawline. This helps to, uh, helps to contour your face. Mm. I don't remember the other word I was going to use, but sculpt. Con sculpt. Con sculpt, yes. Sculpture in your face, yeah. <laughs> and then um, go down the sides. And you can go down the sides on both sides if you like. Okay. Go, go down the sides of the back of the neck a little bit. And then the other side. And then um, now I'm going to show you. Most of these gua sha's that come like this, most of them have a divot in it. So that's a great place to use on areas like... Oh, okay. That, so you can use this specifically across the, the jawline. So you're starting in the middle and moving across. And do you see how like your 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 face fits right in that little divot? Yeah. I think that that is what it's for. I'm sure there's other divots that you can use for other parts of your face. That's true. That's what they say in golf. <laughs> Um, you're you're not going flat enough. Not flat, yeah. just get, okay. So yeah, there you go. Yes, I know oh, that's yeah, the number yeah, yeah. one mistake is people doing this. I see. I did it when I first started gua sha I had no idea what I was doing, and I would just scrape and scrape and scrape, and then I'd have like red marks, and I thought that was a good thing, but it's really not what you're supposed to be doing. Uh, I like it. But this is also getting circulation, microcirculation to all the tissues, all the muscle. Um, there's nothing that's not handy about this you ever just lose what word you were gonna use in the middle of sometimes something? I, f I, f 
forget. I'm going to put this here and just like do a little massage on the either side of my nose, on the nostril, nice. just to get in there. And then I always like to take, you can take the little fingery part and go around your cheekbone to the side. That's just oh, yeah. a little added bonus move. Oh, yeah. Right, go around there. A lot of stagnant lymph hangs out right on either side of your nostril. Psst, typical. <laughs> Lymph just hanging out. I know. Get like, to work. Get go to go to school. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, and then last, we're gonna sweep it down. Mm -hmm. So you've already got it around the neck, right? Mm -hmm. And then you, it, it will go into the lymph nodes here, and mm -hmm. then you can also go across your chest and go, sweep that into the lymph nodes. Okay. Because you've got a set, you've got multiple here, you've got multiple in your mm -hmm. armpits. Um, I mean, they're kind of everywhere, but underneath the the jaw here and then these are, you would do flat as well yeah you just flat against your yeah always flat with with the lymph anything you're doing with lymph is is almost too light it's like you think like this is even doing anything yeah, yeah like the roller yeah it really is doing something but it doesn't seem like it i got you because it's just like rolling across your skin mm. okay how do you feel i feel good i feel like i yeah, I feel more relaxed. Yeah. Maybe it I'll do a little nice. before and after and see if you see any difference. Mm -hmm. If not, then I'm just going to stop doing the podcast. And this people just, we'll just hang out outside near the street corners. Just us? Yeah, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, time. <laughs> we do have a lot of time. Yeah. Um. Oh, I'll, I'll take a little Oh, did you want that? that? Yeah, why not? Yeah, that's a, a, a internal gua sha. It is. It's it's slowly massaging my insides mm -hmm. with. Oh, I didn't get anything. Yeah, you go. Try it one more I time. I know I'm not good at these ones. Sometimes I forget yeah. to. Like... You don't write with those. You just inhale them. <laughs> those are a different type. Of Have I ever held a thing in my hand before? And I used to smoke cigarettes. Yeah. That's something you always want to hear from an esthetician. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Did it go? Yeah, it lit up. There it's just so go. hard to tell because it's like com almost completely. I don't say painless, but like you almost can't feel it. Yeah, it until it's you, out. you can't really feel too much until you're coughing. Yeah, until you're coughing, and then you feel like you've burnt the shit out of your lungs. Yeah. Um, well, cool. Do you have anything else? Anything you wanted to talk to me about that, like, you've, you know, you didn't feel like you could say earlier in the day? Or uh, No, I think we're good. I um, I don't know. This has, like, kind of gotten the lymph out of my system. Oh, I, have and, a, uh, I put this little picture of you. Sorry for interrupting uh, you, but Mark wanted you to see that. That's so adorable. I love my little guy. I will put a picture of, uh, of Booty yeah. uh, with his tongue out. That's our... Uh, giant yeah black and white kitty cat tuxedo kitty yeah and he's got his tongue out always he's so pretty and when i look at him i just he's always when i when i do like his voice in my head it's always like this he it's talks always like this. this yeah because he's just so his always tongue is always out so it looks like he's just so just full of like you know like mischief <laughs> so if you guys uh if you guys even if you're watching this you can't see it so this is just for us i know i will put a picture i, I will put a picture right like in the corner of the screen just change our heads into their heads for the entire podcast. For the entire podcast? Well, okay. just, okay, not the entire, for the, just the, the first. Just the part where we're in. Yeah, the first five minutes keep our faces. Normal. Okay. The rest of it <laughs> with his tongue sticking out. Okay. But this is really cool. I like this stuff. Um, I could honestly see myself like just watching TV and kind of just doing like yeah. just chilling. Like, can you, can you do this? Like if you're sitting there. Yes. Can you, you can do it for like a unlimited amount of time or does no, it. No, I wouldn't go crazy with it. I mean, you know, you probably spend 10 to 15 minutes doing something like that. We yeah. went, you know, probably a little slower than that. But um, yeah, as, as long as you know the, the map of where you're going and yeah. then and you're sliding across and not digging in, then yeah, you're good. You can totally do that while you're mm -hmm. um, watching TV. I like that idea. Yeah. Yeah, and then you always want to have like some oil in your face too. It's never, it's never beneficial to have it actually pull your skin. No, ever. Okay, mm -mm. and yeah, you don't want to do it on dry skin. It will stick the jade or whatever, yeah. whatever they're made of. You can also use spoons. Uh, maybe I'll bring some spoons and try it. That's a, it's slightly different. Mm. Um, but I mean, there's so many different ways to move the lymph in the face, and uh, this is just a fancy one that. You know, I like that it. I like, yeah. Cool colors too. Yeah, and they're not very expensive. I mm -mm. got this one. What I think I paid like fifteen bucks or something. I shouldn't say that. What if I said I'm going to sell them for a hundred dollars? Mm -hmm. yeah. Each one. Yeah. Just for the box. <laughs> yeah, just for the box. Okay. Yeah. Shipping and handling. That's uh, it's it, extra. It's all shipping and handling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, um, anything else? 
No. no. Okay, I mean, cool. I, I still like you. Okay. All right. Well, I guess that's, as long as I'm leaving with that, I'm good. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to um, sign out here. So thanks for checking in with us. Mm -hmm. And uh, mm -hmm. I've, this was really fun. And I'm, I'm really enjoying some of the times that it's just you and me. Yeah. And Mark. I feel, uh, I feel like I've been educated. And I feel very relaxed. Yeah. And I'm stoned. Mm hmm That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I had nothing to do with it. Yeah, well, I mean, like, I'm thinking, like, you know, that's also a good part of, like, it gets you in a good mood to massage your face. Yeah. You know, because you ever massage your face when you're completely sober, you know? Yeah, Maybe it's every fun, day. <laughs> you know? Oh, that's right, you do. Well. Yeah, because you work. Can we get that out of there for yeah. me? This is what we do. Yeah. We normally, the uh, getting the necklace out of the glasses segment comes in the middle of the podcast, <laughs> but we save it to the end. Thank you. So there you go. That's that. Thank you. There you go. Okay. All right. Well, thanks uh, for checking in with us. Um, if you uh, if you have any questions, DM me on whatever uh, thing you follow me on. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to like and subscribe. S subscribe. Subscribe. And that's it. Okay. Cool. Okay. Bye. Cheers. See it. See Stay it. tuned for a little bonus footage. Dude, what the hell was that? What? I don't know. It's just like, are you really into it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, know. I dig it. Why? <laughs> I don't know. Just a look on your face. When, when I was doing it? No. What do you mean? I'm just making things up. Oh, you're just making stuff up. We're pretending yeah. to argue. <laughs> Anyways, uh, but this is like, <laughs> I think, so this, this, this is the part of the, yeah, this is the Patreon stuff. So this is where we get to list everybody yeah. we hate. The, oh, the yeah. Hate. That's right. Okay. Becky Jorgensen. Hater. Oh, she's the worst. She's the worst, right? Mm -hmm. Tell me somebody you hate. Sheila Enigmason. Sheila Enigmason? Mm -hmm. Garbage. She's the, isn't she awful? Totally. And the she's worst. not attractive. Yeah. This one guy I saw last week on my street, I don't care for him. He's the worst. Disgusting person. Did I see him? I think you saw him. That's why I hate him. Yeah, you don't like him because, uh, yeah. Who's a celebrity that you don't like? Who's, well, you know who I can't stand? Hmm. Uh, Oh, uh, what the heck's her name? Uh, Don Knotts. <laughs> Don D A W N. No, no, I love Don. Yeah, D A W N Knotts. <laughs> it's, it's his daughter. Yeah, it's just well, somebody I knew. She was a, she worked at Celebrity Cleaners. <laughs> so she's a celebrity. <laughs> He's a celebrity. <laughs> but I think this is good for people to find out who, and then they can yeah. they can comment and say who they hate. That's a really good idea. Please, but it has to be somebody specific. That's an excellent idea. Comment and tell us all the people that you don't like. Yeah. Who else don't I like? Um. Anthony Kazimakis. Oh, oh God, that's the worst. I, you know what I don't like? You know what I don't like either? His mm. friend, uh, Robert California. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Is that where I got that name? I think Bob Kazimakis, yeah, the guy from The Office. Yeah. But Bob Kazimakis, the guy from The Office. The guy's, oh my God, that should be the name for something. Okay, so here's who I really hate. Okay. Here's, here's what I really hate. Yeah. Nothing, and I hate that. that is, I hate that I hate that I don't hate anybody. I hate that you can't come up with one single person no, that I you can't. hate anymore. What are you looking for? Car keys? Hatred. I can't find it. <laughs> good. I had to scratch my leg. I know. Hate is such a... Hate is... Hate's not good. No. Hate is just H with an 8 next to it. And I hate people who have that license plate. There we go. I found somebody I hate. What? There's people with personalized license plates. <laughs> yes. That's a real thing. Yeah. Did I tell you once I saw one that said Tom's wife, but it said W-Y-F. Tom's whiff. Tom's whiff. So it's like the <laughs> the woman that Tom like could that he messed up with. He's like, and she's like, you know, wearing like a badge of honor. Well, yeah, I got a whiff of Tom's yeah. wife. And all because there was another license plate that was already taken. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Somebody, t t Tom, uh, some other Tom's wife. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Is very proudly cruising around in her four by. Yeah, and then the person he, he then the person he divorced is Tom's whiff. Tom's whiff. Because yeah. he whiffed. He whiffed it. Yeah. Well, I'm going to go now. Um, All right. It was nice to see you. This was good behind the scenes footage. Yeah, it was. <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, it was. All yeah. right. Take care. Peace. See you in the Wait. car. All right. All right. I'm going to go move the car. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching and or listening to Sex, Drugs, and Skincare. Like and subscribe. Wink. No, seriously. <laughs> <laughs>